So, we've spoken a little bit about how Priscilla was, uh, actual Priscilla, Mm. real life Priscilla was quite involved in this. However, and she was happy with it. Yeah. Um, However, um, a little bit before the shoot, Lisa Marie Presley emailed Sophia uh, saying that she really didn't like the way that certain events were being portrayed in the script and that she would like go against her publicly um, if she goes ahead with it. Mm. And I think Sophia was like, oh my gosh, I really don't want to be intruding here. Um, but I'm, I, I think she, I think Sophia was just like, I don't think that, I think she thinks that um, I'm going to do this in a different way to what I intend, how I intend to do it. Like I'm not attacking anybody. I'm being really non-judgmental. Mm-hmm. Um, and so Sophia didn't actually change anything and she just went ahead and did it. And obviously, sadly, Lisa Marie Presley died before she, before this came out. And never got to see it, which I think Sophia is really, really gutted about mm. because she was like, I think she actually would have been pleased with this and mm. it was just a bit of a misunderstanding. Oh, that's yeah, heartbreaking. It's awful. Yeah, it's really heartbreaking. Can I ask some questions to just clarify? Mm-hmm. So um, with Priscilla and Lisa Marie, did they not have a good relationship? I think they did have a good relationship. So Priscilla, though, was really pro this film and her daughter was not. I guess it was like something. I, I Yeah, I I don't think it was. I don't know. I don't think that they were a big clash. That I don't think that's been a thing oh, that's okay. been publicly. But it, it was probably just a bit of a misunderstanding within the family, maybe. Mm. I don't know. Right. Um, okay. It is also the way that memories work, you know. I think, like, me and all of my siblings had the same upbringing and were under the same roof and lived, like, massive life events together and yet have completely different interpretations yeah. of, like, what it was and what it meant and how we feel about it now and... I think that's the most challenging thing. And like, at the end of the day, if you're going to call it Priscilla and it's about Priscilla's book, then I think like making it from Priscilla's perspective is important. Um, but yeah, I mean, like inevitably people can sort of see eye to eye on things and still, mm. you know, still completely disagree with the way that something's like being portrayed. Mm. It's really, really devastating. That's made me feel a bit like, I don't know, just like really... It's such a sort of tragic story anyway, but like, I think sort of this movie coming out and Lisa Marie not seeing it and like the timing of her like really tragic passing and just, I don't know, it's like something like some sort of like energy is like charged Mm. with this family. Mm. (laughs) I don't know, (laughs) like, I don't know, it's something about it it just feels like really powerful but like really devastating yeah do you know if Mm. do you know if they ever thought to delay because the timing of the Elvis film and the Priscilla film I mean they're literally called Elvis Priscilla yeah like would that did they ever think maybe we need to wait especially with Lisa Marie's death um I not that I know of but um with the Elvis film Baz Luhrmann's version, um, he, Sophia didn't know anything about this before she wrote the script. And she wrote the script, um, yeah, so entirely unknown about that there was an Elvis film coming out. But then she did watch Elvis film uh, not that long before she went into production. But it had been, I think, quite a, a long time had passed um, by then. Well, although in saying that, so what, what? That must have come out like January last year. Yeah, mm. and it wasn't that long ago. No. Um, but yeah, not not that I know of. I don't think it got delayed. 